This is the Recon Scout. It's a two-wheel robot. In this Adina warehouse, Recon Robotics creates some of the most advanced micro-robots in the world. Either sneak it in or you can like hurl it up, you know, over the, over the door. Alan Bignall's early career in corporate America propelled him into the entrepreneur he is today. What drives me is, is making a difference. I like to work on products or technologies or businesses that help other people. And then you can drive it around and you can see. Bignall sees opportunity to raise startup capital, bring products to market, and deliver for investors. I'm an intuitive. I look at something and I think it's that simple. People understand it. There's the picture. If I, if I think I can sell a lot of it, and basically then to me it's a good idea. This sixth sense also led to relief neuropathy centers, a laser treatment for nerve disease, and to the Albany Dutchman baseball team. Recon Robotics is all about saving lives. The medical business is all about reducing pain. The baseball business, it's all about college kids who want a chance to play professional baseball creating this opportunity for them to live their dream. Bignall is an evangelist for his craft. What creates the most wealth, the most jobs, the most everything in, in this country is all about entrepreneurism. But for Bignall, running a business is more than about making money. When I started this business, I said, I'm going to start a business I want to work for. So that's why shorts and t-shirts and all that stuff and giggles and there's a nice big old grill out back. And Alan brings a, a, an energy like nobody else I've ever seen to the, the companies that he works with, to the entrepreneurs he presents. To say that Alan has a lot of energy would be like saying a desert has a lot of sand. And Bignall brings that energy to the university as its entrepreneur in residence. When he sees somebody that um, has an innovative solution for something important, he wants to get involved. I think the best example is the hostage situation. The garage is clear, service door is open, we're deploying the robot into the main level. Walk in there, copy, garage is clear, making entry to the main level. The thing that I'm most frustrated by is the, the good ideas that are out there that That's can't the get Kitchen to the right. going. Because the, they're just not either partnered up with the right person or not packaging correctly. Recon Robotics got partnered right from the beginning and received money from the university's Where Norris Institute. By always going back to what's good for the customer, what's good for the employees and the growth. Walkman, looks like you had a person down there, pan back, right there. And what's good for the shareholders. And what's good for Bignall? What I really want to do, my job I really want, the one I'm going to die doing, is owning a baseball team. I'm going to be sitting in the outfield. I got a hot dog in one hand, a beer in the other, and then the guy makes a big swing and the sound of the bat. And then I go, ooh, and that's it. That'd be great. <laughs> the Opus College of Business is proud to present Alan Bignall with the 2011 Entrepreneur Alumnus of the Year Award.